tube, it's tiny. Making another, uh, Woo! make you sick in the belly vlog. Uh, thanks Project Car TV for the idea of the steering wheel. But, hopefully here, soon I will have a mount that I don't have to do this uh, steering wheel thing anymore. But, it's kind of an update, kind of trying to get some parts together to get my car inspected and fix my leak of my oil pan. In my last video I showed you, huh, the horrendous oil spot I have underneath my truck is from my oil pan leaking. So, we have to address that. And it's starting to rain, which is really pissing me off because I was hoping to be able to do some work on my truck today. Uh, i got to get the motor out of the Cavalier and get that crankshaft in it. <laughs> so much stuff to do and just haven't had no time to do it. Um, Mother Nature just will not cooperate with me. And uh, so everything's kind of put on hold. I got uh, my three kids with me and we're out and about today uh, running some errands. Uh, girlfriend is at a doctor's appointment. So the kids and I are out doing some errands and uh, so hopefully I'm going to get to show you guys me fixing a truck doing some, uh, I guess we'll call it redneck body work, <laughs> because uh, I'm just going to patch it up enough that I can get the truck inspected, uh, oops, not really worried about uh, and wind, uh, not too worried about um, it looking pretty, uh, just as long as I can get it inspected and be it and can drive it, then I'll worry about making it look better later, but uh, our laws in Pennsylvania are kind of goofy. Uh, as long as there's no sharp edges and uh, the holes are, if you have a hole in the body, as long as it's patched with uh, some sheet metal and, you know, there's no sharp edges, that's the key. No sharp edges. Uh, it's legal in PA, so uh, I'm going to, now I'm headed to a place that used to be called Beerman's, or an auto body supply place, and I'm going to actually try to get some sheet metal, and uh, I already bought some rivets, freaking a pack of rivets, and this is crazy. A pack of rivets and uh, six eighth inch double sided drill bits cost me $16.91. That's ridiculous. That's absolutely ridiculous. I mean, the 100 rivets was only six bucks. That wasn't bad. But for six of these double sided drill bits, it cost me $9 for six. For six, I think it's six. Hold on. Twelve, excuse me. Twelve titanium double side ended drill bits cost me nine dollars. But you can use both ends of the bit. So that way when you're doing body work, you don't have to keep changing drill bits. You just flip it over to the other side if you break it and boom, away you go. But still, I think that's a little bit high in price. You know, $9 for uh, 12 drill bits. But what are you going to do? I need them. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to make a video of me uh, doing my body work on the truck. I am not a body man. Um, I'm good with motors and, like, uh, mechanical stuff, but... I'm not a patient, I, I don't have the patience for body work, that's why I never went into auto body anyway, um, I don't have any patience to be an auto body technician, it is just not, 
my nature to do so. Um, so hopefully I can get a break in the weather, even maybe today I'm going to try to do some work on the truck, because i got to get this done. Uh, the 30th, my truck is inspected until the 30th, and in my part of the state, thank God, knock on wood, we don't have emissions. Uh, not that, I, I think the truck would pass, because the exhaust on the truck is very quiet, and uh, it's all intact. Um, my catalytic converter is good, and my small pump, I actually, there actually is a small pump on here, and it does work. So I, I, I think I could, I think I would pass an emissions test, I'm not sure though. Uh, but nevertheless, we don't have emissions in my part of the state, so not yet anyway, because uh, the county I live in is mostly farmland, so they've been able to fight it off because there's not as many people that live in this county, so they don't see the roaming need for the emissions, I guess. Which is good on my part because, you know, I think, you know, I think it's a bunch of horse crap anyway. I think it's just uh, a way to make money. But, oh well, what are you going to do? That's how the government is. But anyway, uh, I just thought I'd make this real quick. Uh, share with you guys what I'm doing and uh, let you guys uh, know what's going to go on. So. I don't know, the sun's trying to poke through, so maybe, just maybe, we will get some, some nice weather this afternoon, and I can get some good footage of doing my body work, because it does need done. Uh, I, like I said, I've got to get my truck inspected, so... Oh, Project Car TV, I love you for your idea of putting a camera in, in the steering wheel. I get to make people's uh, <laughs> sick videos. So, and as you guys know, I don't really edit my videos because, I don't know, I just, I, 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 I can't edit them. I just, I, I suck at editing. I have uh, what they say is probably one of the best editing programs that you can get on my computer. And I have yet to figure out how to use it right, so uh, I'm still messing with it. And uh, I, I found some videos on YouTube about it, but they're so vague. And I know another YouTuber who makes videos that has it, I, I, because he said in his videos he's had it, and I sent him several uh PMs and the guy won't get back to me, which is aggravating because, like, he has the same video editing software and his videos are awesome. They come out really good and you try to, you know, get somebody to give you a little bit of help and they refuse to, to help you. But uh, if any of my subscribers has or nobody or knows somebody that has Sony Vegas Pro 10 or 9 because it's it's pretty much I guess the same program uh could you please maybe get them to shoot me a private message and maybe explain to me what I'm doing wrong here because I can't get my videos, like, I can't, I don't know how to remove parts, and I don't know how to, uh, uh I don't know how to remove sections, and edit the, the audio, it, it just, it's really frustrating. The program, I've seen videos that were made with the program, and they're an they're awesome. Like that, that video pro editing program is just absolutely awesome. And I have my, like my version is not like a trial or anything. It's a it's the full version of the uh, program. Yeah, it's not edited or anything. And uh, 
Oh, 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 like I said, I just don't, I can't get figured out. I've never messed with, until I started actually making videos for YouTube, I never, ever, ever, ever did any kind of video work at all. So, to me, editing wasn't important. Um, but, you know, I want my videos to be better, and I want them to, to, to be good. And, uh... I want to be able to edit the videos, and I want to be able to, 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 you know, to do the videos as best as I can. And, um, so if anybody, like I said, knows anybody that knows anything about that Sony Vegas Pro 10 that could give me some help, I would greatly appreciate it. But, uh...